To live is to get hurt. We have all been in situations that we felt that others did us wrong by their words, actions, or indifference. And situations in which we regret doing or saying things ourselves. How can we forgive others and ourselves for good? Is true reconciliation possible or necessary? And how does forgiving help us to lead happier and more peaceful lives? Forgiveness is the conscious, deliberate decision to let go of resentment or vengeance towards a person or group that harmed you. Psychologist Fred Luskin of Stanford University has outlined a forgiveness program that helps us to take things less personal, blame others less, and offer more understanding to the other and to ourselves. The steps involved in forgiveness are know how you feel and being able to express what you do not consider acceptable. Make a commitment to yourself to feel better and to let go. Forgiveness does not have to mean reconciliation or condoning the actions that hurt you. Realize that forgiveness is about inner peace and understanding. Get the right perspective on what is happening by acknowledging your hurt and suffering in the present instead of focusing on the hurtful past experience. Practice stress management to soothe fight-or-flight reactions, for instance by doing mindful breathing exercises. Give up expecting things from life or from other people that they do not give you. Instead, put your energy into looking for ways to get your positive goals met by yourself. Look for love, beauty and kindness. Focus on appreciating what you have instead of what you don't. Amend the way you look at your past. Cherish your forgiveness to transform that story. As we learn to forgive, we are less susceptible to stress, anger, and hurt. By gifting ourselves the practice of forgiveness, we can lead more loving, more compassionate, and ultimately, happier lives.